Hello and welcome guys, I'm Excessive Brutality and this is Excessive Gamer. So this rant is all about digital versus retail. And um, basically, I always liked going, uh, going to shop. That ritual, that, that buying that physical copy, that box opening that wrap. Mm, fucking open that case and see the disc and all that goodness. You know what I'm talking about. The ritual of going to your favorite store, seeing your favorite gaming retailers and talking to them, conversing about new titles, releases. Can you book this? Can you pre-order that? What are the, your favorite porn stars? The color of your socks? All that shit, all that good shit, you know what I mean? So that's all good. Having the hard copy, having a copy with you for life, you know that's going to stick around forever on your shelf, you know what I mean? You might play for a couple of weeks, you might leave it on your shelf for a couple of years, but it's yours. It, you have that sense of belonging. It is something that you physically own. Whereas with a digital copy, you don't own fuck all. You own a code or whatever, and uh, you download a copy onto your trusty system until the PSN network or Xbox Live fucks up and then you lose every single game you own in your library hasn't happened to me but i have heard a story or two where that can happen there are obviously its benefits on a digital copy you don't you don't need that space you don't need to have a space on your shelf to put your games away personally i'm a guy who likes to have my collection displayed for everyone to see and never touch don't ever touch without my consent <laughs> don't ever touch but a digital copy you get um, to have as many games as you can afford and not have to worry about the space or um, people fucking taking them or asking to borrow them that is one of the best parts the fact that people can't borrow your digital game because when people borrow your games what happens is uh, you don't generally get them back anytime soon sometimes never at all I um, have a game over there from a friend of mine I, I, you know Haven, I, I will return that game to you at some point in my lifetime. If I, if I can fathom the courage to get out of my house to see you. <laughs> also, there's another point to this: the fact that right now, as I as I uh, browse through the PlayStation Store, forgetting the fact that we had the Black Friday discounts and all that stuff, all that goodness, all those 60% off. That's crazy, man. I'm not sure about Xbox Live, but I'm pretty sure they had Black uh, Friday discounts. But regardless of those discounts, when you're comparing uh, regular prices, I find that retailers, where you go to get your hard copy and talk about your porn stars and your color socks, those guys seem to be slightly cheaper than their counterparts. You're not getting a physical copy, you know, so they don't have to go through all this packaging and producing and shipping and all this stuff. It's all there for you. On, uh, on the PlayStation Network, Xbox Live, or Steam. So they should essentially be a lot cheaper to buy. Most cases, it doesn't work like that. So I don't know why that is. If there was a significant price decrease buying on digital, then chances are that I would end up going digital anyway. Don't fuck me over, please, PSN. Thank you very much. That's it for me, guys. I'm Excessive Brutality. This is Excessive Gamer. Just before I go... I'd like to say for everybody watching this video, if you are a YouTuber or a streamer, GamingLife.com, my sponsors, have just started a new community designed around bringing content creators together in a place where everyone provides support and encouragement to help you grow. So yeah, I'm there too, so uh, wanna check it out, go to GamingLife.com, community, and I'll see you there, because that's where we hang out. Thanks for joining me, guys. Again, I'm Excessive Brutality. This is Excessive Gamer. Thanks for watching. Till next time.